the most prestigious club competition in European football. And now it comes down to this, the final itself. Who will prevail? It's Real Madrid. They take on Borussia Dortmund. And the action is next on EA TV Live. This is where every top-level footballer wants to be after a long season. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the battle for Europe's Premier Club competition. My name is Derek Ray, and I'm joined for commentary on this final tonight by Stuart Robson. It's Real Madrid against Borussia Dortmund. Well, Derek, it doesn't come any better than this, does it? This has the makings of an absolute classic. These are two brilliant teams, and at the moment, I can't separate them. Federico Valverde plays alongside Jude Bellingham in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. Well, Ancelotti can sense a goal coming here. He's driving his team forward now. This is the lineup for Dortmund. Marcel Zavica plays with Emre Can in central midfield. Niklas Fulkrug is up front. And I'll tell you what, I really admire the fact that Jude Bellingham can do just about everything. He can score, he can set up chances, he can defend. What do you expect to see from him in this game? Well, Derek, he really loves looking up with other players. He's when he's in and around the penalty area, that's when he's at his most dangerous. When he plays little one-twos around his marker, and then plays the next forward pass into a runner. He could be the key to unlocking this defence. It is a Dortmund corner. intelligently and Bellingham on to Valverde well, that's how to do it inside your own penalty area and he has options available save but still a chance now well, threat over for now Well, here it is again, and he's just passed that into the net. That's a very good finish, you have to say. <laughs> 
So the action continues. Will there be a quick response from Real? Chouameni. Well, that's the cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? taken their goal well but the defending was non-existent that should never happen so a level contest 1-1 Henry Jan the ball with Zabitza Junior and he did well to cut it out. Julian Riosong. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. High pressure on David Alaba. Rudiger. to be a massive goal. Just look at his reaction. So the ball is rolling again. 2-1 the score. What's going to happen next? Valverde. And it will be a free kick to Real Madrid. A no card, but the referee clearly indicating that he's on his last warning. Side it is. 
Federico Valverde. And Edo Militao. So two minutes of stoppage time to be added on. And they just to retain the ball in their own half and draw out the opposition. That's a foul, and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick. whistle we've reached the halfway point here at Wembley Stadium available well they seem to be onto something positive but it faded away
Watson. Excellent defending. Well, that one has promise. That was going in. Marcel Zabitza. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And then just take a look at this, Derek. He sees the keeper off his line, and it's such a classy finish. Just lifts it over him. Beautiful goal. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Jude Bellingham. Real Madrid have given it away. Now perhaps they can counter from here.
into 90 minutes. They are level, and extra time is coming up. And the first period of extra time comes to an end, still level here. Well, who is going to come out on top? Let's see if we find out in the second period of extra time.
great awareness of space in the box and then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. He's a great talent. What a run, what a goal, and what a play he is. side despair and heartache on the other but we've got the right winners here they fully deserved it on the night for these players well it's the night of their lives and they're determined to enjoy every millisecond well they have to make the most of this don't they it's a great feat and what an achievement from them well they don't need to be reminded about what comes next it's the presentation of the coveted Champions League trophy. Well, there's some tired players out there, but what you can be sure of, they'll find some energy when they get their hands on the trophy. They'll be going mad in the next few moments. The Champions League winners, Real Madrid. Well, this is what they wanted. What a moment for these players. They've worked so hard to win this trophy. They've been fantastic. And you can feel the emotion. It's natural to reflect on this final, but so much hard work has got into the entire campaign. Memories, memories. And that's exactly what they're doing. 
trotting over towards their supporters to say thank you a collective effort always on these occasions well what more can you say they are the best team in Europe they have to make the most of it doesn't happen very often does it these will be photos to cherish for years to come brilliant stuff and you are looking at the best club side in europe